Get your favorite zombie killing weapons at zombiegoboom.com. Zombies, the bloodthirsty undead. When they arrive, will you survive? Zombie Go Boom, kick undead ass. ZGB Top 10. I want to see what a stab will do, so I'm going to be doing a Troy stab right to the temple area on this side. See what happens. Oh, right. Woo! Oh man, I don't know how far I got in. That's pretty good though, for first try. Pretty good, I think got about three inches. Hey, uh, let's see. <laughs> yeah, yeah dude. Yeah, about three That's four. probably enough. Number nine. What do you want to do next? You want me to just go crazy and just Dude, yeah, go crazy. Hack and yeah, slash? Yeah, hell yeah. All right, let's do that. Oh my god, that's disgusting. Ugh. Holy crap. Oh my god. Uh, stopped before the stand. Oh, that's okay, I got it. Holy moly, walk up. That's a thumbnail if they would let us <laughs> use it. That's so well, they'll awesome. just demonetize it. Number eight. Rolling Nate. Scary. No. That almost came back and hit me in the face. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can see it in the slow mo. Number seven. We're gonna try to make this thing go pop. All right, let's let's light them up. Let's do it. All right, dude, this is the most fun I've had in a long oh, time. Oh, me too. I'm excited. <laughs> Hell yeah. All right. Again, I got seven in the mag, one in the chamber, 380 ACP. This time I've got 15 in the mag and one in the chamber, 40 Smith & Wesson. Yeah. Let's do this. Wait, you want to count it down this time? Sure. Are we ready? Three, two, one. Clear. All right, so we're seeing the same kind of results that you would see if this happened to a real person. Yeah, which is there's a lot of pressure buildup from the liquid inside of the cranial cavity and when liquid is pressurized it has to go somewhere and a lot of times what you'll end up seeing is the skull cap flying up in the air number six nobody calls me chicken zombie head nobody Yeah, keep going. Alright, I'm gonna take a break. <laughs> <laughs>
Number five. All right. So I don't think half spin's gonna work. Why don't we try full spin? <laughs> Are you gonna rebend it? Uh, should I? Yeah. Oh man, it's gonna break. Don't stand anywhere close to this. I'm about nine meters away from the target in order to try to get it to spin one full rotation before hitting the target. I don't even know if I can get it that far, to be honest. But we'll try. Ready? I gotta be a little closer. All right, so steel pieces are coming out. That's what it looks like. Let's do full spin one more time. <laughs> From here. I wouldn't stand there. It rotated, but it also yeah. didn't make it far enough. I yeah. would stand here. a little closer. Yeah. yeah, that's what I figured. Let me finish this. I had to bolt out of there because I, I, I went like this and then I felt it. I felt it snap and it got really light and I knew it was up in the air. The blade was up in the air. So I picture this just coming down like this ugh, right onto me. So I just ran away. Number four. Two. One. That was it. <laughs> That was smell it. freaking perfect. What do you mean? You can smell the uh, the heat from the the bolt exploding. Yeah, that hit right here, right in the center. Where? Well, right there. Number three. Crack, I haven't seen a crack that big since the blob. Woo! This is a confirmed kill with the shake weight, baby. If anybody can do it, Deadpool can do it. And as you can see, this is to pay homage to Shatterstar because of the nice green blood. I love it. Woo! What do you think, Charles? Well, uh, <laughs> I guess, like you said, if anybody could do it, you could do it. It's um, a kill with a shake weight, baby. <laughs> That's pretty oh. cool. Number two. Oh, wow. <laughs> it's 
So check this out. Check this out, Charles. It's ridiculous. Normally we would say, well, that oh, didn't wow. go too far into the skull, so it obviously didn't cause a lot of damage. But since we're using synthetic ballistic gel, we can see that, yes, it only pierced a little bit, like maybe an inch, but look at that crack all across the back of the head around the occipital bone area and it cracked across the temporal bone all the way to the orbit and we're hemorrhaging all the way over here so even though wow. it was, I was only able to pierce about this much into the head that is an insane amount of damage and definitely enough to kill a zombie look if I lift you can see that this entire skull cap is no longer connected to the rest of the skull. So that's insane. And it didn't get stuck. Again, didn't go in very much. I wanted to be accurate. I didn't put a lot of strength into it. But as you can see, just that much was able to do an inordinate amount of damage on this head. Number one. All right, now it's time for a special attack. I'm going to try to decap this zombie by drawing the sword and striking at the same time. I've never actually done this before, so let's see how it works. <laughs> wow! ZGB Top 10 